in our previous classes we discussed the curriculum ante resume bio data and profile and their formats in today we are going to discuss curriculum ante one example these exercises available in our textbook page number 157 in the first exercise is depending on graphic designer you can see if you open the page 157 of our question uh, textbook you can see first exercise that is we are hiring a graphic designer that is the first exercise in our textbook now we are going to prepare a curriculum with a depending on the given first exercise the first one for which job we are arriving curriculum with a means graphic designer that's why position as a graphic designer this is objective this is the objective this curriculum with a should start with objective what is our objective for which post we are writing this curriculum or preparing this curriculum with a means for a graphic designer that's why i wrote here position as a graphic designer now details details means the person who is going to write the curriculum with a his details have to be presented in the following format name name should be written in capital letter name for example your name is ravinder k ravinder okay next up father's name this is also date of birth means the birth should be written in capital letter date of birth date of birth depends on giving giving uh, means given exercise what is that a graphic designer if you see textbook you come to understand very easy for example your original date of birth should not be written okay after reading thoroughly the given exercise you come to understand minimum 26 to 20 years of age you should consider and decide the date of birth but don't write your original date of birth for example i am writing here 17 5 the age becomes 28 years next gender ravinder is male that's why right male next one marital status whether you are married or unmarried unmarried or married for example unmarried right unmarried don't divide the word unmarried it is only one word write together unmarried next contact or email what is enough you write your mobile number or email id for example email id or anyone should write double line 8941812 or you can write your email what is that ravinder at the rate of gmail that anyone should write whether you are mobile number or you are email address next one present address this is also we can write in the form of current address any one word only you have to use present or current anyone now you read this present address first you should write house number house number 10 dash double one by a brindavan ali nazam bits pin number 506132 the next permanent address
if the permanent address is also present address you don't uh, again write just you write do both are same present address and per permanent address both are same now academic qualifications this is also called educational qualifications first uh, you have to go through the given exercise without reading and without understanding the given exercise it is not possible to decide what is the qualifications i am writing here qualification i am completely writing depending on the given exercise only this qualification clearly mentioned in the exercise in the given advertisement what he has asked a diploma or any bachelor degree graduation that is also called he has given graduation or a diploma now you can write diploma or graduation now see the number one this must be written means academic qualifications or educational qualifications should be written in a tabular form means total that should be as like a table this is called as tabular form first you have to write serial number means how many this should be written in chronological order means high qualification to low qualification you have to write i already given some advice advice when i explained in the format in before class we discussed what is the format how to write the tabular form what is the first column what is the second column what is the third column and next and next we discussed so the first one serial number next column qualification means this is also known as course what you have completed next name of the institution where you have studied year of study means in which year you have studied percentage aggregate now serial number 1 what is the qualification what he has asked in the given advertisement or given exercise he asked a diploma or any degree means graduation graduation what is the related graphic designing post we are writing we are writing for graphic designer that's why suitable qualification should be mentioned means bsc that is graphic designer is related to computers so you have to write computer that is bsc computers in graduation level okay you have completed bsc computers next where you have studied siddhartha degree college where national tests next year of study in which year has you have studied leave the experience years consider the experience then you have to decide the year of study that means you have completed that in the year of Twelve. Base three years degree course. Twelve to eleven, eleven to ten, ten to nine. Total, they become three years. Nine to ten, ten to eleven, eleven to twelve. Three academic years. Base degree three years course. So three years you have to show. Then your percentage is you treat as eighty three. If he gives the percentage in our given advertisement you have to mention the given details as it is if they did not give any particular details like percentage year of study you have to imagine yourself and write your own and the next one chronological order i told you means high qualification to low qualification you have to write high qualification is here bsc next uh, low qualification next uh, qualification is our next course is intermediate intermediate is or just write inter with the npc inter with npc where you have completed kapitiya graduates junior college nasa 
in which year completed this is intermediate course is for two years means 2009 academic year to 2007 academic year means 7 to 9 you completed two years you have to mention the 82 percent or 90 percent as you wish if he give or if he gives the same means in a given advertisement the percentage if he mention the same advertisement should be written means the same advertisement details it should be written means there is no any percentage mentioned in exercise that's why i imagine myself and i have mentioned here 82 percent and 83 percent if you imagine 90 percent you can 90 or 95 percent you can go with that as you wish the next one SSC. Okay. Now SSC you complete uh, that is ZPHS National Test. Now in which year this is only one year course. So 2007 to 2006. This is the last one. Don't write uh, okay below means 9th uh, 8th classes. Don't write. Only up to 10. Why? Because this is the first step in our life. Okay. Up to SSC, you have right. Means here, three level qualifications we have mentioned. One is BSc. This is higher one. Next one, intermediate. And the least one is SSC. This is this uh, system is called as chronicle R. Means high qualification to low qualification. You keep in your mind, don't mention SSC first. And next intermediate and the BSc last. You don't write. First higher qualification is BSc after degree intermediate after the SSC. In this pattern, in the tablet form only, you have to present. The next one, technical skills. Clearly, the technical skills are in a given advertisement available. If you read the advertisement or given exercise, you come to understand clearly they mention here that is proficient, must be proficient in Photoshop. Illustrator, Corella, Quark Express, InDesign. What are they? They are all graphic designing courses. Okay. You are proficient in that. So that's why you have mentioned uh, the same given uh, what uh, technical skills uh, you have to mention. We mentioned. Next one. Languages you know. How many languages do you know? You know Hindi, Telugu, English. Telugu, Hindi and English. If you know Urdu as well, you can write Urdu. Three languages are enough. The next one, interests. What are your interests? Okay. Reading books. If any interest, you can write, no problem. Two or more. Okay. Or uh, another one is browsing. Internet. The next one, strength. What is your strength? Clearly, in this advertisement, he has given one strength. What is that? Innovative and result oriented. That he has given in that the same one you write. What is the strength? Innovative and the result oriented. This is your strength. These two skills or strengths are suitable for the given job or given advertisement. What is the job? Graphic design. The next one, experience. If you have, you have to write. In our date of birth column, we have written nearly 28 years. Means at least 4 or 5 years experience you have to mention here. Okay? Well, because you completed uh, BSc computer course in the during or duration of 2009 to 2011. Means uh, 12. 12 to now 2020 means this is all your experience at least four years or five years you can mention means uh, experience working as a graphic designer with 
का एल एंड डी सॉफ्टवेयर कंपनी एंड हाइड्रोबाइल द नेक्स्ट वन एक्सपेक्टेड सैलरी हाउ मच नेगोशियबल नेगोशियबल मीन्स शूटेबल द नेक्स्ट वन रेफरेंस How did you get this information? You know this about means about this vacancy. You got this information or about the vacancy. You hear or you have seen in newspaper means daily or any person informed. What is that? You can write anything, whether name of the newspaper or any person's name. For example, name of the newspaper, the Hindu. Daily. On which day you have observed this advertisement? On twenty-seventh August two thousand twenty. The next one. This is the reference. The reference you can write any daily name, any person's name. Okay, available on request. The next one. Last finally, before this final one, you can write a declaration to. But it becomes lengthy. If you feel it became lengthy, you don't write declaration. If you want to write to score four out of four for this curriculum letter, you have to mention declaration. Okay, place where you are writing this means from here, from Assam. Where you are writing your native place, right? And date uh, on which date you are writing this or preparing this curriculum letter today? Okay, today's date. What the fourth? Nine, two thousand twenty. Now signature. In this uh, signature part, you have to write up your signature. The signature should be in capital letter or your sign. That is as a wish. What is your name? Your name is K. Ravinder. Okay. This is this is your signature. Now, okay. With this, we have completed curriculum meeting. Tomorrow. we meet with the another topic